Hey everybody, my name is Flurbisher, and welcome back to the episode of Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword. Well, in the last episode, we got all of our items back, items back in Elder Volcano, met with the Fire Dragon Din, I believe, I believe that's his na her name, I think. And also did the last side quest, including Patros. Well, at least for like credited crystals. And now Patro is a human, which he so long wanted to be. And now we're going to the narrow desert. Point to your preferred desert area. All right, so we can pick this time. Nice. Well, I guess we want to go this way. Um, let's just do desert entrance, I guess. I honestly don't know. Um. Oh boy. Yeah, we haven't been there yet, so... Can we search for it? No. Um... Lenero Mine, Lenero Caves, I guess we just have to go there. Um... Yeah, let's try to go there. And see if there's like another way we can use to continue forward, I guess. Oh yeah, this is where we need to be. Hi, over there, is that you, Link? Nice timing. I have been meaning to look for you. Come over here for a minute. Um, alright. Nice to see you, Link. So, you ever find that sacred fame you're looking for? Really, you did? Great! I was pretty curious about it, so spill all the details. I see. So after all that adventuring, you finally found it. Link, I have to say, you were pretty amazing. You are not the only one. I found out some more about the legend of the three dragons. This news is going to blow your mind. I have found out that there is indeed a hidden area beyond here. There is a narrow path that I cannot fit to without losing a few pounds. My theory is that it probably linked to the home of the Thunder Dragon, one of the three dragons in the legend. And I am convinced that these robots must have something to do with it as well. The Thunder Dragon, a bunch of robots and time shift stones. What a story! Well, he has actually been... Oh. Alright. Oh, he actually has been... <coughs> He actually has been kind enough to actually open the way forward for us. Come on, wallet. Here we go. Oh, calm down, it's just an explosion. Well, let's crawl to let's crawl to here. And then we can get to the area with Well The fucking dragon. It's actually not that difficult. Oh, but there's gonna be a catch. There's always gonna be a catch. I know it. Uh, nothing special here. I mean, do we actually have to like really look for secrets? Because I don't think we have anything left. Uh, just a normal whoopee. That's another card as well, but I don't really care. Yeah, just to make it appear, I guess, sure. Oh, it's not, it's a gossip statue. A gossip stone, I mean. Which gives us a monster claw. Actually, I have like none of them, so that's actually kind of nice. Cool, I said actually in like... The same sentence twice. That's actually really annoying, actually. <laughs> that I meant it on purpose, of course. This is the narrow gorge. Legend tells of a dragon to the god that's living in this area. Oh, loyal to the god. Yeah, that makes sense. The narrow gorge. Wow, it's gorgeous. Yeah. <laughs> Sites indicate that an ancient civilization established a quarry here to mine the deposit of high quality timeship stones. Consequently, the terrain is intricately 
subdivided with the remnants of long abandoned mining equipment, such as minecarts and tracks. You know, like the fucking entire area of Lunaru. Oh, that's... That's very square. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Well, we got a bird statue, so we don't have to go through the caves again. Uh, some rocks over there. Uh, we can use the pedal for that. Um, I think that's the way we need to go. Oh. Oh my god, is that what we have to do? The dragon is dead. We actually have to bring the dragon back to life. Oh my god, that's actually really amazing. That's really cool. I mean... Whoa. I was not expecting that, I honestly. So we probably need to bring a time shift stone all the way to here. Alright. We can do that. Well, the new colon, huh? In the mind. Bring the fucking dragon back to life. Jesus Christ. Alright, let's see. What do you have to say? There's a lock. Oh, there's a lock the uh, door. Entry to the area ahead is allowed only by permission of its thunder dragon, Lenero. Oh, were they, were they just named after the um, uh, areas and not the goddesses? Uh, Alright. I don't know if I have to do something with that. Uh, there's nothing else here, so... Okay, cool, I guess. That's great, amazing, wow, jumping! Platforming! Uh, maybe I just need to follow this track. Uh, definitely not, no, not like that. Um, do I need to fucking loot its corpse? Like, do I need to find the key in his belly? Is that what's happening? Is this big chain a fucking key? Oh? I see something there. There's something glistening over there, so... Maybe? Oh yeah, wow. That's actually really nice. I, um... Fuck. I actually like that, yeah? That was cool. If I can just get my people to do its work, that would be also nice, but... Yeah, I like that. Uh, it's like kind of environmental uh, storytelling kind of thing. Like, you, you see a fucking tablet with uh, saying that uh, you need permission from the dragon. You see the dragon skeleton. I saw the chain, so I decided to look... Uh, I saw this chain and thought, oh, maybe the key is on there. Then I saw it like going off the edge and I looked off the edge and there's the key. I, I actually really like that. That made like complete sense. <laughs> Fuck. God damn it. <laughs> oh. Oh boy. Alright then, let's try that again. Well, open up. I don't know where the rock like down there for is. It's that's a bit weird, but 
Oh, I guess it's fine. Alright, some pea heads where we need to use the uh, claw shop for. Come on, that was that was a hit. Alright, let's see, just around this corner, some more bugs, I don't care. We have a time shift stone. Let's turn it on. Well, he's just trying to do his work, but I don't care. Um, keep going. Do I need to talk to you to make it go? Oh yeah, I do. So I do care. There are lots of big times of stones here. Did you get permission from Master Thunder Dragon to come here, like we did? Warum? We were just about to transport this times of stone in Master Thunder Dragon. Weep. Oh. There are many Oh god, that's actually kind of scary. <laughs> honestly, that's kind of scary. I mean, honestly. Like you're just talking to him, to him, and then he just dies in front of you. All right. Oh fuck you! Wait, do I not have a shield? Yeah, I do. What? No, oh, I hate you guys. Just die. Goodbye. <laughs> Die. So it's kind of like an escort mission, but not really, because this cannot get damage, of course. Which is uh, way better. Come on, die, die, die. Open up this. Yeah, so we just keep following this. Oh, which? Oh, I just attack you before you have the chance to, like, actually do an attack. Or defend yourself. There we go. <laughs> Easy. Uh, where's the button for this? Oh. I have a slight clue. Yeah, there we go. Um, I don't know why this is like that, but this is very inconvenient. I know, I just need to follow this. Oh god, uh, which way is the correct way? Does it matter? Oh god. I just pick away and stick to that. Um, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Fuck, fuck me, fuck me. Die. Uh. Uh, oh my god. Oh, it stopped. Cool. Woo! Now what? Uh huh, yeah. Got it, got it, got it. Oh, this is actually kind of fun. It's basically now the scroller, actually, now that I think about it. Oh, let's just wait a bit. <laughs> that is definitely gonna kill us. Alright, move to the side. Wait again. God, the fucking cliffs are farting. I mean, those are definitely like ass cracks. There we go. And then we let go here. All right. Uh, what? Oh, that. Yeah. Then we go over to this. Uh, let go.
We wait for that to be normal. All right, now we're just waiting. Come on. Come on. There we go. Going from stalactite to stalactite. All right, now it's stalagmite. There we go. And then some vines. Let go. Oh, getting pushed around a bit. Oh no. Fuck off. <laughs> We're like at the end of the game. We know what jelly plops are. I mean, we are so close to the end of the game. And the game is still like... Oh, you know what jelly plops are? I don't think you do. Like, no, we know. It's like... We have like 50 of them in the pocket right now. Uh, oh, right, yep. Yeah. The whip time. Uh, how far is it? Quite a bit of distance, but alright. Uh, fuck, fuck, fuck. Alright, just... Die, all of you. Oh, oh, oh. The fuck is that? Come on. Die. Uh, uh, uh. Come on. Link, Link. God damn it, Link. There we go. Fuck you. Oh, oh god, that was close. Alright. Uh, some more of those. Not really that difficult to get to, but oh, this might be a bit more issue. Uh, yes, luckily the white side seems to be the safe side, so... Away. And... Uh, come on. Link? Link? Link. What? What? Why can't you... Oh, that's a bit odd, but sure. Come on... There we go. A bit odd that he... Come on, let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. A bit odd that he can't grab onto that, but... Fine, I guess. Oh, fuck off. Oh my... Come on, sideways. Sideways. Get off me. Oh my god. Oh my god, what the fuck. Oh my god, so many enemies. Oh, why are you on the track? Who the fuck built this? Hello? Hello? Beemos? Oh. Come on. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck your eye, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. Pull the switch, there we go. Almost there, my god. Let's do a better gift to us for free. Die. Oh, I need to throw a bomb there. I can tell already.
Uh, yeah, there's a bomb over there, so we can use the beetle. Hey, what's that over there? A god is... Wait, what? It's a goddess cube that's not in my notes. Um, cool. Where is that? Oh wait, we can't reach that yet. Oh wait, that's fine. No. That's a bit odd. Um, I guess I looked over that one. Interesting. <laughs> that might be the last goddess chest then. At least I hope it is, because I have, I don't have any other uh, goddess cubes, I mean. Uh, I don't have any other ones, like, written in my notes. Uh, we'll see, I guess. I wouldn't even know how to get to there. Oh, he's... This has to be something about it. Yep. Oh, it's... Oh, now it's a big area. Hello! Well, before we talk to him, I actually want to check out the fucking... <laughs> yep, there's a bridge. Oh. Federation critical for it. Must not have that. Uh-huh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't care. Oh, really? All right. Well, I guess in the next episode, we'll see why the Dante Dragon is sick. And we'll probably have to fix it. So there's still some more to do. See you guys then. Goodbye.